Hey, it's Jabbo. Welcome to Brickzar. A long time ago on this channel, I did videos of all the SpongeBob sets that I have, which I think is all of them, as far as the regular issued sets. And these got all put away into a box, but not individually bagged. And then we took them to Philly Brickfest when they might be bricks. Took the Fiery Fisto Pain roller coaster made from CDX blocks. Because it was my intention, I was going to use some of the things from this uh, around it. Uh, around Bikini bottom, bottom, like maybe the bus or something. Uh, so, yeah, those got taken up there and weren't used. I think we used some of the figures. And then everything just be kind of became destroyed. <laughs> and I think some of the elements we used elsewhere. And so now I was like, you know what? After all this time, after several years, I need to get this back organized as I begin or continue to work on the slow process of organizing my entire collection. So I rebuilt all of the sets to kind of figure out what parts are missing. I made a list of the parts that are missing, and now I'm going to take all these sets completely apart and put them in individual bags. So this will probably be the last time that they're all assembled together. In fact, I gotta, I gotta get. They might be Brick's permission. This has actually been right up there with all the yellow characters: McDonald's, Ronald McDonald, and uh, King Ghidorah, and the uh, Zooter thing. <laughs> uh, so, but I'm thinking about taking it apart because it's very dusty. The big Build a Bob set. So there were 14 SpongeBob sets, and I built all 14 of them yesterday and I'm filming this today and then the next step is I'm going to take them all completely apart put them in bags I got the list of the parts that are missing and I as I find those are they're, they're elsewhere in the collection uh, but just going to do a quick overview this isn't intended to be a review of these I've already done videos on these and yeah I could probably redo those videos and make it a lot better but it was painful enough trying to to rebuild build all these from a big pile of parts It'd be easier if they were just all bagged together individually, but they were all jumbled and broken together. So, you know, you got orange parts from three different sets all together. It was, yeah, it was a, it was a challenge uh, to, to rebuild these. So what are the sets? Um, well, one of the largest is Mrs. As, as, as far as space it takes up is uh, the boating school, set 4982. I was messing the SpongeBob minifigure with the, the tongue sticking out and the antenna on top. Uh, that's one of the key parts that I'm missing from that set. And so I got to find that. Uh, don't know where it is. Have no idea where it is. Uh, we got this uh, p uh, bikini bottom party set. I don't know, remember what it was called, but set 3818. Did have most of the parts for this one. Um. I made a list. 38. Oh, yeah. I'm missing Mrs. Puff. So, for some reason, Mrs. It showed Mrs. Yeah, Mrs. Puff's in this set. And I don't. That's such a big minifigure. I don't know where, where she is. I mean, she's in that set. Uh, the Rocket Ride, one of my favorites. Uh, we are actually missing some things in that one, I think. What set is this? It's 3831. Oh, no. That one was complete. Um, there is a, uh, a set with the Spongebob, Patrick, and Sandy in their rocket um, uniforms and a magnet set. I never bought that, and I now kind of wish I did, because that's one of the more valuable <laughs> magnet sets there is. Uh, I do want to try to get it at, at some point. Uh, this is 3834, this Spongebob's house. Um, now, oh no... Have I mixed this up? Oh, great. Now I've mixed things up again. All the, all the grill, all this stuff goes with that. What does this go with? I have done it again. I have mixed everything up again. This one... Oh. This one goes with that. Right there. Uh, 3827. See how easy it is to mix all these up? Then we got the the tiny crusty crab set 3833. <laughs> the bigger crusty crab, what set number is that? 3825 as I break it. <laughs> BBI. Um, we got the chum bucket. Now the chum bucket is also missing some pieces. It's missing I'm missing a frying pan of all things. 
and a couple other small pieces. But notice the discoloration on the blues there. These are all from the same set, and I have found that um, parts from that era, two, this is 2007 set. Um, yeah, so they're, those things probably came out in 2008 when I got this. But those, the discoloration, I've found that with the same parts. Um, some of these blue elements have that kind of discoloration with them. This is another small set. This is um, 3816 uh, Ventures at Glove World or something. So Sandy's in this one. I can't remember if I was missing a piece on this. I feel like I was. Right now I can't think of what the piece is. We got Glove World, uh, the bus driver, or the Glove World bus. Bus driver lost his head, his hat. I mean, not his head, his hat. And several of these I'm missing the version of Patrick that goes with them. That's the other thing. Uh, here's the Flying Dutchman set. Um, did have the minifigures with it, but I can't remember what else might be missing. And so I think that's it. So there's one, two, three, four, five. Oh, yeah, this one, this little set here. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen sets. So that's all the regular sets. There's also the magnets, the keychains. I, th I think they even had. Um, I do have one of the magnet sets, and when I locate it in the collection, it's going to go in the box. So I'm going to be taking all of these apart to fit them in gallon size bags, the ones that will fit in gallon size bags. I think the ones that got base plates, those don't quite fit in the gallon size bag. Uh, I may find a little bit bigger of a bag to put them in. And I'm going to take all the instructions, and I'm going to keep those together and group instructions by theme, numerically by theme. <laughs> So they'll go in a binder by themselves for the SpongeBob collection. And that's uh, that's how I'm going to go about getting this messy collection organized. So then if I need to get one of these sets out for whatever reason in the future, I'll have to rebuild it if I want to see it again. Uh, but I will know that everything is there uh, once I come up with some of the missing parts. Yeah, that's where that brick went. You know, I had an extra one by four brick. And I couldn't figure out where it went. <laughs> and that's where it goes. Get it out of this. I can't get it out of the bag. Right here. So, so I may need to double check some of these. Did I even built them right? There we go. And also had a log brick left over. I gotta figure out where it went. I'm sure it went in one of these sets. Probably went and might have gone in this one or that one or probably this one. The head log bricks. Uh, yeah, so those are kind of my random parts that were left over. Probably built some of these wrong. And I am. Oh, one of the sets is missing one of the. Uh, the one that has the Krabby Patty mobile thingy. Which one was that? It's this one. Uh, it is missing that right there <laughs> so i have got to find the krabby patty mobile i think we used it uh, when we went to philly brick fest and it got put in another container so i'll be looking for it uh, so as i find the other messing elements uh, i'll be gathering together so yeah that's the spongebob collection one last look at it before i take it all apart i'll ask they might be bricks if he's okay with me taking this apart but i'll probably take it apart anyway oh also, the yellows on this starting to look different colors. The yellows are yellowed. <laughs> uh oh, I knocked one of the... This came off with this right here. One of these uh, has four, and another one has three. Now i got to figure out which one it is. I think this is the one... Yeah, this one has four. Whoops. These things are... This is so annoying. These things are very fragile. I do not like that attachment of a piece. Um, yeah, there's... Th these aren't the most stable sets. All of them. And the rocket ride is not stable. None of the houses, none of SpongeBob's houses are stable. Probably the best built thing is uh, Build-A-Bob. <laughs> uh, Krusty Krab, I don't like. Missing... Oh, yeah, I was missing a 1x10 reddish-brown plate on that, so... 
yeah, a few random missing elements that I have got to account for. Made a list of it. But that's what I'm doing. Organizing the collection. And these are all going to go in this big container here. And any other SpongeBob sets, if they ever make them again, will go in there if it will fit. Oh, and the boxes. What about the boxes? They're mixed in with all the other boxes. I'll eventually do a update of organizing the boxes. Not something I really want to tackle right now when you got thousand plus boxes. <laughs> empty boxes <laughs> oh another story for another day anyway thanks for watching see you in the next video